Alrighty, here is another video request that I was, uh, you know, requested to make a video. <laughs> uh, that did not sound right, but anyway. Today, I'm going to show you pebbles how to overclock mildly your non-K Intel Ivy Bridge processor. So, uh, a while ago I did this, um, shortly after I got my, actually no, I did it before I had my water cooler. Um, but yeah, I have a Intel Core i5-3330 in there on an H80 closed loop um, water cooling system. And I've overclocked from 3.0 to 3.4 gigahertz. So, yeah. Now, I'm not sure of the whole chart thing uh, for different Intel CPUs, but I'm pretty sure you can go 400 megahertz above the base frequency. Um, so that's the maximum you can overclock a non-K. So, all you gotta do is uh, go into your motherboard's BIOS and adjust the multiplier in the uh, overclocking settings. It's really not that hard, but I'll show you anyway. So you go ahead, restart. I have an MSI motherboard, by the way, just for this demonstration. Not just for this demonstration, but I'm using an MSI motherboard for this demonstration. Go ahead and tap the crap out of the delete key until we get into the BIOS. Still tapping. There we go. So we are into our BIOS here. This is the MSI Click BIOS 2, just um, in case you're wondering. And as you can see right up there, it says Intel Core i5-3330 at 3 gigahertz, but it says current CPU frequency 3.4. And uh, yeah, so all you got to do is go over here to your overclocking settings. This is going to be different in every motherboard, but every motherboard BIOS, but now you click on that. And then you don't even have to adjust voltage or anything like that because it's all automatically um, handled by the the BIOS. So all you have to do is go to uh, CPU ratio, CPU multiplier, anything like that, or anything related to that. And then you just go ahead and select any multiplier. Now I selected the maximum 36 uh, multiplier, but I couldn't do it. So it's safe to assume that you can only go 400 megahertz above the base clock and that's been confirmed on the internet too So, in this case my multiplier was set at 30 but i set it to 34 so you're just going to click there don't double click and that is it and then all you're going to want to do is you're going to want to restart and your cpu should be running at your um, selected speed so if you have a 3 gigahertz processor like i do you'll be bumped up to 3.4 um, and I would confirm this, just go back into your BIOS and confirm it. I'm not going to do it, but... Or you can use a program like uh, CPU-Z, Real Temp, or, you know, something like that to tell you what your current CPU clock speed is, but... Yeah. So that is a very quick tutorial on how to mildly overclock your non-K Intel CPU by 400 MHz. Thanks for watching.